Flav and I, we definitely had a trying day today. I packed my bags. You know, that's a sign. Not because I planned on leaving, but I didn't know if he was going to ask me to leave tonight. Tonight is a crazy night. I know I appear calm, but this is giving me the jitters. I'm like, oh, because I really want this. I feel at home here with him. Who's getting the next clock? Flav, can I step out for a second? Can I say something? I thought she was just going to give a speech and rat out hottie or something like that. My father just got in a terrible car accident. Before elimination, one of my friends left a message saying that my father got in a terrible car accident. You know, the car is completely totaled, and, you know, I don't know how your dad's doing. I didn't want to show my true feelings to anyone. I still love you, but I would like to be there for my family right now. Therefore, I'm eliminating myself. All I kept hearing in my head was, go home, go home. You need to be with your family. I knew that I had to do something. I'm very, very sorry to hear about your father. And I just want to say that myself, everybody here is with you and your family right now. And if there's anything you need, holler at your boy. I'll be right there for you like you have been here for me. Absolutely. You've been here for me, man. That's why I was keeping you around. I appreciate it. You need to know that. Thank you. I miss you, man. I will miss you, too. It surprised the hell out of all of us because she hadn't told anybody. I don't know what's going to happen, but I hope the hottie is eliminated because she brings so much negative energy to the room. She's not the right one for Flav. Tonight, ladies, the rest of this elimination ceremony is deceased. I want to say congratulations to the ones who got clocks. Congratulations to the ones who don't have clocks. This is for Oyster, my family. Um, is everybody all right? New York? How you feel? Well, I'm having a little issue, you know, because I feel I want to know if I was going to get a clock or not. I'm struggling with that. Well, you know what I say? If you was going to get a clock, you would have you got a clock. If you wasn't going to get a clock, you wasn't going to get a clock. Don't let it bother you. Okay. I already know that this is where I belong. I have my bed already decorated in the his and hers suite. So New York really, really needs to leave. But she thinks that I'm the one that's going to go. So I think she's delusional, completely delusional. These other ladies really better step their game up, like seriously. They have no idea what they're dealing with over here. This is my man.